When are you going to divorce your wife? Soon, baby. Wait for it. Wait a minute. Oh, it's time. I have to make dressing change for that loser. Why can't he just die? Oh, just wait a minute. Honey, I'm coming to serve you. Why are you so angry? I know you're one of the top ten richest people in the world, but now you're a total wreck. Don't provoke him. If he dies, I won't get any penny. I got it. Are you ready? I can't help it. Ah. <sighs> What is the hurry? Don't you think this is more exciting? Hi, Yu Tian. I'm a billionaire, but no one around me really cares about me. Now I'm humiliated. What's the money for? What's the money for? What's going on? Aren't I already dead? Nineteen eighty-nine. This is the chance God gave me. Let me start over. Who are you, honey? Don't scare me. I know I was wrong. I'm begging you to stop hitting us. Don't hit mommy. She didn't mean to do it. What are you talking about? Since when do I have a wife and a daughter? Yu Tian, you still know to come back. What? This is my home. I don't have to check in with you. You must give me back the money for our kids. Fuck you. She's a girl anyway. Let her die. It's better if we have a son. Yu Tian. What are you doing? Our kid is not a fake one. Go fuck yourself. Still want your money back? Are you still human? Yeah. You. You're my wife. You're my daughter. I always hit you. Yu Tian. It doesn't matter what you do to me, but Dodo is your own daughter. I'm begging you. I'm begging you to help her. I was born again to be a person of the same name. But how did I become a dad? I wasn't preparing for this. Dodo, Dodo, Dodo. What's wrong with her? It's bad. Dodo is having another heart attack. What? You too. We are taking her. Where else? Hospital. Doctor, help my kid. Help, doctor. I want treatment. Please don't hit mommy. What's up? What's going on? Doctor, please take a look. My kid is having another heart attack. Because this heart attack, she has a high fever now. I suggest get her hospitalized ASAP. Raise the money for surgery ASAP, or else I'm afraid she won't live much longer. Now go to the hall and pay your bill. Right. You still have money left? No. You squander our old money, didn't you? Such an animal! <laughs> Believe it or not, I promise. From now on, I'll be nice to you. I don't need your promise. All I ask. Is give us a way out, honey. Let us stop talking. Can you go home and get Dodo's suit? Sure. And give this money to our next door Feng Sen sister, as utility bills. While we are not at home, don't let her tear up. 
She does. Why wouldn't her dare? Did she hit you? It doesn't matter. Just give her the money. Eh, eh, eh! Remember, this money must not be used for drinking. No worries. I'll be right back. What happened to him? Why is he like a different person? And hurry up, move! Move them as fast as you can. Hurry up! Stop! What are you doing? What am I doing? Paid off debts. You don't pay utility bills, then I will take your family belonging to pay the bills. Put that down! You're in my debt. What do you mean? You slapped my wife. Pay her medical bills. <laughs> you are trying to blackmail me. I tell you, it won't work. A bitch like your wife. I hate her. She deserves it. <laughs> I don't need your money, but I won't pay your bills too. In your dreams. As for the utility bills for three months, you cannot pay the penny less. <laughs> Good. Then I'll slap you too. <laughs> This one is for my wife. I will pay your bills. If you bully her again, it won't be a slap next time. You are a bad lad. I've never met such a man. Waro, Dodo, I won't let you suffer anymore. Nighty nice. Prices have risen this year. This is an age of extreme price polarization. Agricultural products are cheap. Industrial goods are expensive. Flour is forty cents a tin. Potatoes are five cents a tin. The price of a plasma TV is twenty thousand yuan. Now the most important thing is to get enough food. In this life, I'm gonna take the lead. I just follow the tide of history, pursue profit. Sure, I will make a fortune. To make a fortune on a small cost, the easiest way is to get into the food business. But there's so much food manufacturing. Which one should I choose? Mom, I only buy this once. Only eat this package. You don't eat homemade rice and noodles, but you have to eat this expensive instant noodles. Right, 1989. China's first instant noodles came out two years later. Boss, two packets of instant noodles. Well, I'm gonna let my wife taste it. Here, five hundred dollars. Thank you. Thank you, Director Joe. I will pay you back the five hundred yuan as soon as possible. Director Zhou, don't call me that. Say, brother. Besides, on behalf of the factory, I should give some money to some poor employees. However, that's not enough, right? Yes. The doctor said, "Total surgery need to be done by a specialist." It will cost over ten thousand at least. Oh, how poor you two! I sympathize to you. What about? I pay you up front. Really? Of course. Director Zhao. Ah. I've worked in the factory all my life to return your kindness. I will do everything for you. Ah, <sighs> my girl. You don't have to do everything. Just promise me one thing: ten thousand yuan is a piece of cake. Director Zhao. Ah, call me brother. Brother Zhao, please don't do this. I got married. Then get divorced. You can get divorced. Think about your daughter in that war. No one but me can help you. You can't count on that loser, Yu Tian. I. I don't need your answer now. Just think about it, huh? There's no need. She won't get divorced. Yu Tian. Director Zhao, our family will be no trouble for you. The two of them, I can take care of. You piece of shit! Say that again. That's enough. Let's go.、Mm. When Yao is not with you, can't even afford instant noodles. But with me, this is a piece of cake. Yu Tian. Ah, here, take it. A hundred yuan, enough for several packs of instant noodles. Ha 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 ha.
<laughs> You're crazy all the same. It's a piece of shit. Director Zhao. Since I'm a piece of shit, do you dare to bet with me? If I can get the money for my kid's surgery in a month, I'm gonna make you pay. For what? what you if you win, I'll leave Wan Rou. But if I win, you must kneel down and note three times to me in front of everyone to apologize. Sure. Let's bet on it. A month later, don't forget to attend my wedding with Wan Rou. <laughs> You shouldn't have made a bet with him. We are in a such bad financial situation. Can you raise ten thousand yuan? Are you worrying about me? I'm afraid you are gonna lose me and Dodo to someone else. I said it. I'll look after you two. I can't leave you either. Then you. I'm good. The moment he made a bet with me, he's already lost. What do you have in mind? Trust me, this is 1990s. When gold is everywhere, when he hit me, I figured it out. You know, this tastes terrible. How come this instant noodles is so expensive? How can it taste bad? Because it doesn't have a seasoning bag suitable for Chinese people, like what I had before: braised beef, lautan sauerkraut, and seafood. Very delicious. <laughs> You must be bragging. I'm no bragging. This is 1989. Yes. China's first instant noodles came out two years later. What are you talking about? What's wrong with you? You'll see. Within a month, I will let everyone in this city know me as Boss Yu. According to my network. He's the only one who has something to do with the food business. Hello. Hey, man. Right here. Ah. Ah. Uncle, sit. Yeah. You can. Did you rob a bank? Or win the lottery? Haha. <laughs> right, uncle. Boy. My nephew says you want to do business with me, right? I'd like to buy your processing plant. You there? You're drunk? Kidding me? I'm not kidding. Uncle, name a price. At least two hundred thousand. Huh? Two hundred thousand? Two hundred thousand. You afford it? Too much. I can offer twenty thousand. What? Huh? You there? You're playing us? Break your legs! <laughs> Take it easy. Listen to me. Say it. Twenty thousand to buy your processing plant is a little cheap, but I'm gonna make you an offer you can't refuse. Well, is that? Before we negotiate, I'd like to ask you: Can you see a bright future of your factory? Nonsense. Future is promising. Haha. Nineteen eighty-six. Yuanfeng Instant Noodle Factory introduced the batch of instant noodle production lines from abroad. Successfully produced the first batch of Yuanfeng fast food. In a few years later, has made good money. Led to a large number of small instant noodle factories springing up. But Boss Zhao, are instant noodles for small capitalists like you? As for seasoning bags, they use sauce bags, and you, not tasty. No reputation, and expensive. You still think your factory has a bright future, boss job? You are looking for people to take over your factory a month ago. Am I right? Talk about it. What are your terms? If you can sell it at twenty thousand, I'm willing to assume all the debts. I'll take on all the debts. How's that? The offer is a good one, isn't it? That's what I know. You're broke. Come to my house tomorrow, and you'll see. 
Beatrice, pack for me. Mr. Zhao, I believe that in the whole city there is no one else who can provide such offer. You can make 20,000 net and get out safely. Think about my offer. This mail is on you. Fuck you! You came here today just for a free meal! I'm gonna fucking kill him! Forget it. Thanks, Mr. Joe. Uncle! He's not here for business, just for a free meal! Today he took advantage of me. Next time I make him ten times or hundred times payback! H, you owe me three months of electricity bills. But you really don't have any money. No money? If you don't have money, why don't you sell your body? You can't don't screw it around. Ah! Tian, come down, this could kill people. I know what I'm doing. Just teaching her a lesson. So she'll shut up. But it's our fault first. I asked you to pay the electricity bill. Why didn't you pay? You lied to me. That's because... Where the fuck is this? Bambi! It's him! He hit me last time! Now he wants to kill again! Go, oh, go! Oh. You tear. Tired of living, you jerk! Brother and sister, my husband had some wine today. You are all the bigger persons. Please forgive him. Fuck off! Honey, you okay? I'm fine. Go ahead and apologize now. Bambi! Don't talk to him! Beat him up! I'm gonna kill you today! Uh, fuck! Fuck yourself! Ah, uh, uh, my dick! This is called triplet. Who else? <laughs> Bitch, don't bother my wife again. Come to me. Understand? Yes, edit. Let's go. What? When you get home this afternoon, you slap Auntie Fatty. Right. She slapped you. Cause I'm gonna return it. Do you know what our family is facing? How could you offend Auntie Fatty? Yes, you made your mark today. She would definitely come back for revenge. I didn't care about before. But from now on, you are my bottom line. No matter what. Nobody can bully you. Alright, no worries. I will get our family back on its feet to deal with them. Yutian? Yes? You've changed a lot. You... are powerful now? Wasn't I good before? What is yes? Didn't you have a psychological problem and you became an alcoholic? Well... Shall we give a shot? I'm sleepy. Then sleep. I'll go to the hospital to see Dodo. You'll have to take over my shift tomorrow. We're back. I'm going to the hospital to see Dodo. Take a rest. Sure. Honey. Take it easy. Have a seat. Where the fuck is this house? You wanna try this? From my uncle's factory? <laughs> it is a bit shabby. But it's valuable. Huh? Once these places are out of use, it'll be demolished the house. Now it's 40 square meters. It'll worth... A big house with a hundred square meters. In the future. <laughs> Demolition is indeed a trend. But you only got a hundred square meters. Try it for my factory? Mr. Joe, I'm telling you. In less than 10 years, this house will rise tenfold. You are just bluffing. I never heard anyone who lacks a house to live in. No demand. How can it raise us? Go fuck yourself. You know nothing about the trend. It'll never be the same in the future. Now we open up. People want good lives. Every family is getting rich. Besides, 
75% of our population are peasants. When they flood into the cities, this house will surely rise in price. Seems like I must sell my factory to you. This is the transfer contract. If you agree, sign it. Yeah, you never went to school and can't read. Just sign it, Mr. Zhao. You have led several minds. How good! You're my nephew's classmate. Check it again. No need. I'll sign it and take the risks. But I have two conditions. What? First, after I transfer the house to you, accept the house in mine. Sure. Second. Add a quote. The stock of your factory, twenty thousand cases of instant noodles, and all the materials all belong to me. Mr. Zhao, you want to benefit from me. I want to get benefits from you too. Business. We strive for a win-win. If that's okay, it's a deal. Deal. Uncle, are we? Cheated by that loser. Huh, your uncle me. Cheated by him? I'm telling you, this year I took a bank loan of eighty thousand. The collateral is this factory. Ah,、oh, huh? Our factory was mortgaged to the bank. Of course. Otherwise, how has our factory survived? When it only spares at the end of the year, the factory will be auctioned off by the bank. That's why I'm selling in a hurry. Whoa! Eh?、Huh? What you have done doesn't seem to comply with the rule. Rule? I am the rule. I have spoken to the bank. To this, they are turning a blind eye. By the end of the year, bank takes back the factory. Workers were asking for the wages. Material merchant for the debts. He doesn't have money. Will he sue me or jump off the roof? <laughs> Smart, Uncle. You dug a big hole for him. <laughs> you are so bad. Typical operation. This is business. Hooking, trap, mortgage, house selling, purchasing a house thirty years later is more complicated. Shameless person. This <laughs> man looks familiar. Son of a bitch! Ah, I would kill him. You know who I am, huh? It's your fault, and I slept with your wife. Know who I am? I'm Zhang Sutong. Zhang Sutong. Know me? Know me? Fucking know me? Know it? Know it? I know it. I know it. Right. My childhood friend Lee. <laughs> Fuck. Who are you? Your dad. Yu Tian, are you asking for the death? It's between we couple. None of your business. Huh? You are asking for the death. Don't intervene our couple's business. Huh? Get out. You cheated, and you're so confident, bro, bro. No, she's my wife anyway. For my sake, forget it. What? What had my bro done wrong? Huh? He worked so hard every day to raise you. And this is how you pay him back. You don't agree? You can ask him to divorce me. I'm willing to. As long as he'd agree, I cannot agree more. But do you know he's such a worthless creature? Cannot kick him off. He's born to be a cuckold. Wang Chunxia, you animal! Don't stand in my way. Get away! You son of a bitch! Want to teach me a lesson? If you are so concerned with Din Li, return the money that you borrow from him. You. I owed money from my bro. I won't deny. If you still stand here, I'll beat you two together. You just try, bro. Please, bro. Please don't. He's just a tool. We can't afford to find him. Just let him go. Let's go. You did it, right? Fucking wait for it, bro. 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 <sighs> Bro, remember, one day I'll revenge for you. What have I done wrong to marry such a wife? 
I knew she cheated on me. She did it outside before. I never expect she brought a man home. You say, if I come back later, I won't see them. Why don't you get divorced? I'm so poor. If I get divorced, no one wants me. I have no child. I can't face my late parents. Don't lose your ambition. Bro, from now on, you're with me. In the month, I'll make her kneel and apologize to you. Bro, trust me. Okay, I'll be with you. Where are? She's asleep. I brought you some food. Did you make this food? Right. Take a bite. In the past, you never step into the kitchen. That was the past. From now on, I'll cook whatever you want. Mr. I, hmm? <sighs> Thank you. You're such a happy couple. So sweet. These days, what are you busy for outside? The cost of surgery, how much money did you raise? I have a plan. Our family cannot suffer more. No worries. In a month, I'm sure to win a bet with Zhao Tiezhu. This is my promise to you and my child. Eh, it's him! Our new boss! You are... I'm Lin Qiang. You were with Zhao Zhanyuan that day, I saw you. You wanna come in? Pay our wages first! Pay our wages! Pay our wages! Pay our wages! Pay our wages! Listen to me. Here's a question. You ever signed labor contract? Obviously, none of you have ever signed labor contract. Then how can your wife be the debt of our factory? The one who promised to pay you was Zhao Zhenyuan. You'd better ask him. Am I right? You're you're passing the back. You're same as Zhao Zhenyuan. Oh bastard! Guys, beat him! Ah! Uh, who dares to beat my brother? Uh. You can't beat me. You can't beat me. But what's next? If I'm still not paying you, what's next? Now you only have two options. One is, beat me. But no money at all. Or, son is, official labor contracts. If you're willing to stay with me, every month, I'll pay you extra a hundred. 100 yuan. We can earn 200 a month. Bro, are you crazy? We can broke. If you don't trust me, at least you can trust the contract. As you sign it, the only thing to do is to bet on time. And I have already put everything on the bet. Think over. Leave or stay. I stay! 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 Good! We have a day off today. Let's go to the market at a price of 50 cents a pack. Sell all the factory inventory. 50 what? cents? We have no profits. Hey, shut up! Now we're following boss you. Listen to him! Okay. Move on! Boss Yue. Your words may fool others, but not me. You may be a good guy, but you can't do business. Oh? Why did you say that? At Pengcheng's food market, Xinwang Group controls 80%. Even though the instant noodles market is promising, but for local people, when they buy this expensive food, they are not only concerned about its mass, but also about its quality. Therefore, small brands like us couldn't last for a year. Lin Qiang, 
How talented you are! Today, business market research comes first. Enthusiasm is useless. Very well. In a month, I occupy the entire market. Then promote you to general manager. <laughs> You're dreaming. One month, occupy the entire market of Pengcheng. <laughs> I occupied the Pengcheng market in a month. If I hadn't done it, I would sell all the things to pay my debts. But if I make this factory a success, you work for me for the rest of your life. Bet on it. You're gonna lose. I'll take that as yes. From now on, you're the head of workshop. Huh? <laughs> I was already it. I'll double your salary. Bro, uh, what about me? You do what you're good at. Accountant. I need someone I can trust to handle my money. Ah. <gasps> uh. By the way, bro, you said instant noodles are only 50 cents a package. It doesn't cover the cost. Why not? Let the workers negotiate with the bosses. Bring the price up to 70 or 80. You really think I want to cover the cost? These instant noodles are not competitive. What I want is to sell them quickly and get my money back. Uh, time can convert into money, but money can never buy time. I see. Boss, there's a man outside. Sell a big boss. Wants to invite you to, to dinner tonight. Which big boss? Bro, I don't feel good on this. Don't afraid. Take measures as the situation calls for. Business is a battlefield. We're going. And you're gonna eat more. How's it going, Yu Tian? No. I should call you Boss Yu. I forgot to tell you. Zhang Sitong, he's the son of the owner of the leading local company, Xin Wang Food Factory. We can't mess with him. It turns out that Boss Zhang wants to invite me and my bro to dinner. <laughs> Who's this? This is my uncle Zhou Qiang, boss of the edible oil factory. Oh, it's Boss Zhou. In the future, my instant noodle factory We'll rely on your oil factory. I have renamed my factory, Panda Food Processing Factory. There's no need to remember your factory's name, cause tomorrow, it'll get out of business. What you mean? Means, you give me your factory. What? The buyers and sellers in business. What you mean give? What you think? You kicked me before! You think I'm gonna let it go? Boy, my nephew spent a lot of money in the hospital because of you. To take your factory against your debts, it's a bargain for you. Bro! What if I say no? You! I'm telling you, don't embarrass yourself! If my uncle doesn't supply you oil, let's see how you open your factories! I'd rather not to use your oil. Pengcheng's instant noodles taste so bad, it has a lot to do with your oil factory. The oil produced by our factory is certified as healthy oil. Every food processing plant in Pengcheng depends on our oil. <laughs> we don't. I'm going to use a new technology to take over the market. I'll see you in business. Uncle. Don't be angry. In a couple of days, I'll find all his creditors back. We'll see how he starts! We're done, bro, Tian. They don't supply us oil. How we make instant noodles? We shouldn't do it in a tough way. I have already think about it. Our instant noodles will not be made by soybean oil. I already signed a contract with the palm oil factory. What? Palm oil? Right. Palm oil fried instant noodles are better shaped. And solve the problem of being unpalatable after fried a long time. Moreover, it is cheap. It is the most suitable to deep fry instant noodles. There's a new way like this? Never heard of it. In many ways you never heard of. Next, we're gonna revolutionize the technology of making instant noodles and launch a new product. Pen the crispy instant noodles. But Xinwang Factory has already made crispy instant noodles. Can we compete against it? Huh? Of course. Huh? Competitiveness. Lies in this formula. What's this? Mix the seasoning packet into the flour. Fry together. No need to add seasoning packets. Open and eat. So many flavors. 
<sighs> In a few decades, you'll find out. Compared to the main, people prefer the seasoning packet. Whether it's barbecue or hot pot. Lin Chang, ah, tell the workers start producing tomorrow at least forty thousand packets per day. What? Forty thousand? Can't do it. We can. We can. But the more we produce, the higher the risk. Forty thousand a day. If we can't sell it, what should we do? Business is a big gamble. If the sky falls, I take it. Get ready. The day after, it's opening meeting. Did you hear that loser sold a house? Who's that? Who else could be? Yu Tian. Yu Tian, did you sell our house? You heard it. Don't cry. Just selling a house. We'll buy a bigger one later. Buy? Do you have any money? Do you know how important this house to me? Listen to me. Those are now in hospital. We can't afford the surgery. Selling the house is the quickest solution. You mean you're selling the house for pay dodo surgery? Yes. To be precise, exchange. I exchanged our house for a you processing factory in Daps. No worries. Within a month, I'll sell all the Daps. Dodo's medical expenses. I'll take care of that too. Just trust me this time, all right? People, I'd like to announce our Panda Food Processing Plant today officially opens. Wait, you dream of it? Your new boss. Who are you two? Predators. You already take over the factory steps. If we can't get a step today. You can't open your factory. You're finally here. I was expecting. Ding Li, Ledger. Hmm. We are about to sell off the starch factory for three thousand eight hundred yuan. Boss Wang, twenty six thousand yuan. Boss Liu, fifteen thousand four hundred. Li Chunhua, Li Chunsheng brother. Eight thousand yuan. Is that right? Ah,、uh, the total is more than ninety thousand. I'll never repudiate. But you have to wait another month. What? You gonna repudiate? Come, smash things. Wait, bosses. Try our new crispy noodles. After that, you'll see. Is it worth to wait another month? Why is it so delicious, bosses? The cost of this is very low. Its price, compared with the other brands, is only half. Under the lure of extremely low prices, will attract a lot of buyers in a short time. Therefore, just give me a month. I'll make up for what I owe you. Tastes good doesn't mean it'll sell well. How can you guarantee we can make money? Check out today's student daily. The headline. Panda Instant Noodle Factory opens today. The new product, Crispy Instant Noodle, is launched. Precious collection cards are included. Ten pieces for a lucky draw. Top prize is a hundred yuan. A hundred yuan. What's so great about Student Daily? It's not as famous as Pangcheng Daily. The Crispy Noodle's main customer group is students. Next, we'll open up the student market. Small profits, quick turnover. What you just tasted is just the basic flavor of scallion. We also have chocolate flavors, barbecue, and malatang flavors. Think about it. Such instant noodles, post case can resist. Right? I know. You must have heard a lot of bad things about me, especially from that Zhang Sitong. But his real goal is to kill my factory. As for your interest, he wouldn't even consider it. But if I'm broke. You two can't get a penny, bosses. Think about it. We will sink or swim together, boss. You, I can't give you another month. But when is due if you can't pay it? Don't blame us.
What's the situation? It's too difficult to deal with them. Took a few words to get us away. Fuck. You're so useless. Go away, go away. <sighs> Boss Zhang, I'm sorry. I let you down. Don't get too excited. We're just started. I'll see. Who will buy your trash? Brought here. We're ready. Eh. Good. Let's jump to Tong Si. Why business is battlefield? Everybody, 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 guys! Panda Processing Factory launches new products: crispy instant noodles, limited to 100 packets. Come first, served first. Is that the instant noodles from the Student Daily? I've seen it. I heard it has chocolate flavor. Really? Chocolate is so expensive. Now let's have those crispy noodles. Ah, boys and girls, you'll find out if you taste it. It's free. Come on, come on. <laughs> what kind of flavor do you have? What kind of flavor do you have? Mmm, it tastes really good. Well, it's a small packet. No, the packet is more. It's cheap. One packet, just ten cents. What? So cheap. Children. This time is free for you. Come on, bring more if you like. Thank Go you. home and share Thank with your you. friends. Guys, pan the crispy instant noodles. Crispy and delicious. Okay, only 10 cents a packet. Try free today. Limited to 100 packs. Wow! Did you miss me? Mm. Yes. I haven't seen you in a few days. You have lost so much weight. Ah, oh, I'm working out. Look, I'm strong. You keep these money. Buy whatever you want. Don't worry about money. Where did you get all this money? I might in business. Might not too much at first. When things go well, there's no problem paying for Dodo's surgery. Since we were married, it's the first time I have seen you take that much money home. Take this too. It costs over 2,000 yuan for this paper pepper. It's nothing. I bought two. This is just for you. This is just the beginning. In the future, I'll buy you TV set, electric fan, and refrigerator. We'll buy them all. We can go back. I need to go to the factory. Wait. I have to go. I'm gone. Boss, you are so smart. Pan the crispy instant noodles is known by everyone in this city. It's called hunger marketing. Thanks to your student daily. Giving us a way to publicize. Come in. Editor Pound, right? Ah. Oh. <laughs> I'm the director of Sock Factory. Zhao Tia Zhu. Mayor Sun sent me over. Ah! Yu Tian! What you doing here? I'm here to talk with Editor Pound. You? You piece of shit, what can you talk? Hey, I'm telling you, you better not hang around the editor pound like a dog. Talking? You're kidding. Director Zhao, this is a school. Please watch your language. Editor, you don't know that. This man is a ruffian. He beat his wife. Doesn't care about his child. Ah, even his processing factory was bought with a house mortgage. You say, such loser like this deserve to talk to you? There's such thing. Yes. We also made a bet. If in a mind I can pay for my kid's surgery, he gonna get on his knees and apologize. <laughs> you say that like you can't win. Remember, it's a week before our bet expires. By then... Don't act shameless. The same goes for you. Interesting. I'd like to see who wins and who loses. <laughs> In this case, when that happens, I call you ahead of time. How about you be a witness? Okay. 
Okay, then it's settled. Out of the palm. I gotta go. Ah, uh, let me walk you out. Eh, uh, it is a palm. We're not done talking yet. I was introduced by Mayor Sun. Yeah, you wait for it. Such a bully under protection. By then, I'm gonna make you. Editor Palm, thank you for showing me respect. <laughs> He's a terrible person. I don't like him. But you, you're different. Haven't you ever doubted my past? I only believe what I see. I'm sure in the future you can be somebody. Meanwhile, I also hope Vox News promise to support the school's newspaper. It's not a joke. You hit my word. I'm nothing like Zhang Zetong, a mercenary businessman. Bro, something come up. Hurry back to the factory. I gotta go. Bro, Tian, the owner of the raw material factory that asks for a price increase. Five cents for every catty. What? Big news! Zhang Zetong's Xing Wang food factory is on fire! Calm down! Although the fire was more, but I heard the goods were all burned up! Virtue has rewards! How could I forget something so important? Isn't it a good thing, boss? The boss of the material factory raised prices. What? Xing Wang Group just lost 10,000 cases of goods. Zhang Zetong will surely find a way to make up for the loss. On one hand, the crazy stock up on materials. On the other hand, Build up prices and disrupt the market. No wonder the price is rising. Let's go. Screw them up. Boss, you. What are you doing here so early in the morning? You know exactly what I'm doing. I'm here to negotiate the price. Don't waste your time. No money? Get out. Zhang Zetong? What the hell? You don't take care of the accident at your factory. What are you doing here? <sighs> Just a small fire. It's been taken care of. By the way, what worries me most now is that demand exceeds supply. <laughs> oh, boss Chen, wheat flour at five cents for every kelly. Don't sell it to anyone else. Ah, oh, I wonder why boss Chen has suddenly raised the price. Turns out you broke the rules. Rules? What rules? Money is the rule. Very well, boss Chen, ten cents every kelly. You selling it? Ah. Uh, <laughs> Boss Chen, 15 cents. Don't you forget, who's your biggest customer? 20 cents. You dare? You playing with me? I offer 30 cents. I do 40 cents. Uh huh? Boss Chen, can you afford it? If you can't, go away. Get out of my sight. I'll do 50 fucking cents. How's that? I'm fucking rich. <laughs> All right. I admire you, Boss John. You win today. See you around. How dare you set me up? What you fucking looking at? Damn it! Bro, how's that? Both of you, find some local unknown newspapers. Tell them there's a problem with the oil made by Xing Wang. Better ask some bombshells. Understand? <laughs> then I'll do it in my way. At Xing Wang Food Factory, several people died in the fire yesterday. The reason is using resin oil. <laughs> what a good story made up. <laughs> Bro, Tian, Hongzhou Economics headline is sales of Xing Wang Factory plunged. 3,000 cases of crispy noodles are on the market. The supermarket owners heard the rumors. They even pay up front to snap up our goods. Eh, that's what big brands get. <laughs> Our brand is small, but we're well known. All the supermarket owners in the city knows about us. Of course. Plus, we've been implementing hunger marketing. They gonna think, if they're a second late, they can't get a goose. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the noodles. Put here, put here. Rich! <laughs> Lin Qiao, you go outside, check the people who come to stock up. We're in short supply now. 
Must be a lot of speculative dealers trying to get some money out of it. We can't let them ruin the reputation of our factory. Come here. Today is the day my bet expires. I'm going to the hospital to arrange for Dodo's surgery. No problem, bro, yeah? I can't handle this. Okay. Yeah. Isn't this Boss Yu? Who are you? Ha <laughs> ah, you've made a fortune lately, then you forget about me. Me? What? Eh, in the past, you borrowed money from me at Loan Shark. How much you want? You borrowed 2,000 from me. Yeah, compound interest, 2,000. Becomes 20,000. Bro, Long. Someone asked you to do this, right? Here's 4,000, I'm in hurry. How much money you get in the back? Then give it all. How much you get from the man hired you? I'll double the price. Let me go. Cut the crap! You take out the money yourself, or wait for me to do it. <laughs> you are not gonna give it to me, are you? Go to hell! Eh? Why not? Uh. Director Zhao, what brings you here? I come to check on Dot. Is she getting better lately? Yes. Come here's 200 yuan. Buy some snack for the kid. No, I cannot take your money anymore. Don't be so polite to me. You forget about the bet? I and your husband made a bet. If you lose me and Dot. <laughs> Well, uh, let's go outside to talk. What can't you say in here? Talk right here! Director Zhao, the bat... Can we just let it go? Hmm? Let it go? I can't let it go. And I got someone to be the witness. Hello, Editor Pang. This is Zhao Tiezhu. I'd like you to be a witness. Such a trifle. Why bother added a pound? What's the matter with you? Are you okay? I'm okay. Had a fall. Uh, <laughs> you Have you got the money for surgery? Oh boy. Look at you. Would you say that the money for surgery was wrong? What are you doing? How could you hit Director Zhao? It serves him right! Here's 26,000. You know what's it for? Save me my daughter's life! How oh, dare you play dirty with me! Ambush me halfway! Huh? Only 4,000? Ah! Uh. What did Zhao Tianzhu send you? Uh, yes, yes. Take the money. You can use it for medical expenses. Remember, never trouble me again. Thanks to my careful consideration, didn't put all money in the bag. If I fall for it today, can you bear the consequences? Now you see. This money. It's enough to pay for my daughter's surgery! Our bat should be fulfilled right now. The bat? You don't recall. Listen, whoever loses, will have to apologize by countdown to the other three times! Yuja, your request is so impolite! Impolite? Was it polite when you touched my wife's hand? Was it polite when you humiliated me? Was it polite when you robbed my money from a case emergency? You dare. Don't you push me too far! <laughs> Shut up! Kotel! Why don't you help me out? Why don't you help me out? What a good play. I was so lucky to catch the most exciting. A 
Senator Pong, Mr. Pong, do me a favor, please. You're a man. Director Zhao. A man should fulfill the bat. Zhao Tiedu. No one gonna help you today. Kao Tao. Stop. Only children Kao Tao. Please don't beat anybody. You look brutal and scary. If you call me Papa, I will agree. Okay, poo poo. Not poo poo. It's pa 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 poo poo. Before my poo poos get angry, leave now. Well, take our kid back now. Thank you for coming today. I treat you to dinner tonight. Okay, see you tonight. Gotta go. Mister, what Dodo said just now was your guidance, isn't it? <laughs> Facing opponents, call it defy. Facing family, gentle and kind. That is a real man. However, you can't be too tough. Wherever is possible. Just be lenient. You're right about it. I did act impetuously just now. For young people, it is natural. I heard from Dodo that、uh, Panda Crispy Noodles has gone viral. That was luck. Keep moving on, young man. In Pengcheng City, more and more people know your name. Thanks for the encouragement. Be honest to me. How did you get so much money? From my factory. Really? You got twenty thousand yuan so fast? This is just the beginning. By the way, starting from tomorrow, then work in Zhao's factory. When Dodo recovers, let's open a supermarket and be the boss ourselves. Right. I will take your word.、Mm. I gotta go. Wait. Has the best expert to perform surgery on Dodo. We have money, huh? Boss, Xinwan Factory has refuted rumors about rising oil, but that's no use. I heard the issue of returns worse than that of sales. Huh? Within my expectation, Junli, pay off all the debts and let the raw material factories continue to supply for us. Lin Xiao, publish a recruitment notice. Tell everyone our factory wants to expand. Thank you, Bro Chen, for your recent help and care. You've changed my life. No problem. I heard that you're expanding the factory. How's it going? There anything I can help? Speaking of that, Bro, can you do me a favor? Tell me. We have wide network. Can you help me to import some equipment from abroad? <laughs> I haven't had access to some equipment from South Asia. I heard that machine is so advanced. The production capacity is three times of your factory. Thank you, Roger. But I have to remind you: do not play hardball with Zhang Sitong. The Xinwan factory is just a toy that his father gave him. But Xinwan Corporation is not a toy. I got it. I know my next step. Jin Lie, what happened to you? <sighs> Nothing. Fell over on the way. Fell over. You must have fought someone. Is that Jun Si Tong right? Just a moment ago, he came to her rest, Chen Xia. So I fought with him. Fought with him. Seems more like being beaten. Let's go. Um. No. Come. Still <laughs> alive. Can't take beating. Don't bully my bro again. Every time I see you, I hit you. You've got guts. Darren hit me. Just beat me. It's not the first time I beat you. Why don't you learn from your mistakes? Fuck you. Sito, your day is different from yesterday, and we are on the street now. Yes, that's so. I should give you some face. You damn、oh. bitch! 
You're about to get divorced, but you're still helping these dudes, huh? What you think? You think he follows you can't face up money? Now you want to crawl back into his bed, huh? I didn't mean that. <sighs> Sign the paper. Divorce. Divorce. Yes. The house belongs to me. Tomorrow morning, you out. Wang Chunxia, have some shame. You cheated on him first, but you want him to leave alone. Ah! 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 Ah
Huh? <laughs> Dad! Apologize to him, there's a wall right away! Apologize! You want me to say that again? Heather Palm, I speak without thinking. Hope you won't take offense. Editor Palm, please forgive me. I won't hug it with younger generation. Thank you, Editor. But, he offended the guest I invited. Apologize to you, Tia. To him! Nonsense. Hurry up! You there. I'm sorry. It's okay. Pong Chun is with Mayor Sun. You must show some respect, you know? As for your face, reclaim it at the auction. Ladies and gentlemen, friends, welcome to participate in this event organized by Pong Chun Municipal. That we've discussed it before the event. All the guests present at the scene will show respect to Mr. Lu. Any of Yu Tian's items won't be bidden on. Then, let's prepare to watch the show. In every edition of the charity donations, I've had the donations. This year is no exception. I brought with me. That's the richest man in Hong Kong, Lu Meng. Heard of it. In business circles, anyone can be offended in this city. But you can never offend Lu Ming. Alright, let the bidding begin. 3,000! 5,000! 10,000! Zhang Yuan has a good relationship with Lu Ming. You be careful. Bro, so you're leading me into a trap here? No joke. They might be setting a trap to make your items go unsold. What did you bring for today? Secret. I promise I'll surprise you. Congrats to the owner of Xing Wang Group. For 28,000, Mr. Zhang made a bid of Qing Dynasty Porcelain. 28,000! Three auctions have been held and this is the highest bid ever! Thanks to Mr. Zhang! For charity works in Pengcheng, he deserves credit! It's now the auction items that value. It's the heart that does charity works. I've been the lead for three years! This year! I hope someone can surpass me to prove in our Pengcheng there's a rising star. Today if someone donates an auction item worth more than mine, I will consider him my successor. From now on, in Pengcheng, I, Lu Ming, will be his tutor. I'll make a start. Okay, come on up. Today, on behalf of the Xin Wang Group, I'm bringing in a Santana. Santana? That's over 200 pounds. Oh, that's a lot of money. That's bold. We've been in the food business for 13 years. As the industry's leading enterprise is bound to play an exemplary role. So, this card starts at 150,000. Bravo! Any other guests brought an item of greater value? I wonder, what does our recently popular boss Yu brought to the auction? I don't think it's necessary to be a climber for Charis. Just be honest with your conscience. So, our boss Yu is admitting defeat. But even so, he's always put up for auction. Why don't you take it out earlier? If it's unsuccessful, you can leave earlier. The reason I don't want to compete with you is because you don't deserve to be my opponent. He doesn't know why he's, he's crazy. so arrogant he's because he knows The lot I brought today is this. <laughs> Business license. Right. You kidding me? You're donating the pen to process and plan? Why not? Huh? Ah. Yes! This table analyzes and values the factory in detail. The firm has a total value of about a million yuan. If I dare to bring the document, I don't want to bring it back. Please don't doubt my sincerity. It's only been a month I came to Pengcheng for business. 
I'm nowhere near the boss's here in terms of strength and resources. But I do have one advantage. That is, I'm not interested in money. So no matter how big the game is, I'm ready to give it all. I always take it. So the price here is at the million. In case the auction fails, 800,000. No one's bidding? Poor star. Haven't you always had a problem with me? Why not bidding off my factory and left me desperate? Why not bidding off my factory and left me desperate? No way! Alright, I declare. No bids for Panda Factory. Since I'm here, I can't come for nothing. I made a deal with Editor Park. Every month, 10% of profit will be donated in the name of the student daily to help end the privileged children. As long as our factory stays in business, my donation is open-ended. Ken, aren't you afraid that the factory will really be auctioned off? 800,000 is a huge amount though. But for Lu Ming, it's easy to take it out. Haha, <laughs> they're all rich people. But the richer a man is, the more careful he'll be. Processing plants are not like antique paintings. It's not a one-shot deal. Lu Ming has much money, but he does take out a million and throw it in. It's true. Businessman and never wants to lose his money. What about Zhang Setong? What if he lets you push him around a bit on the factory? Then I give it to him. But I have many ways of keeping him down. The family John won't lose face for nothing. Next, they're going to target on your weaknesses. What do you think my weaknesses are? What makes you rich is your weaknesses. Right. The Xinwang crop also thinks so. They're already working on instant noodles. Well, I tell you, my weakness is not instant noodles. Then what? Probably my family. <laughs> Man. You boy, still thinking about your family at this critical moment. If I were you, I once have the gods. Bro, Tian, something's wrong. Come back to the factory. Mr. Wero, I'm in a hurry. I have to go. Why are you still eating? Poisonous! Right? Come with me! Fast! It's got to be John Stone's doing! Should we get some major newspapers to dispel? Won't work. They must have been prepared. Except Editor Pong. No one's gonna help us. We're fucked up! What then? They started playing fire. Don't blame me pouring oil. Burn them down! Boss Lee, it's not easy to see you. Ha! <laughs> you already screwed us over. You're competing with Xin Wang. Why did you drag us into this? What the fuck is color oil? If I hadn't signed a three year contract, I'd have cut you off. Don't say that. Now you and I are in the same boat. We strive for a win win. Behind the scene one crop, there's Lu Ming. I can't get into this mess. The only thing I can do now is to make sure in three years I won't cut you off. Taking on Xin Wang is my business, but you and I have more important business. I want you to sign this contract. Don't respond yet. Think over it. I'm now the leader of the food industry in Pengchun. Think it over before it takes sides. I'll wait for your call. That's too much. Why are they saying it's shoppy instant noodles? Anyone get sick? Or somebody died? Baz, we can't go on like this. We have to stop the rumors. Let's go. Stop. Ignore them for now. These people are literally sent by Zhang Tong. Let's go and catch them and ask them. Then the problem's solved. If they dare to do this, they must have prepared perfectly. 
What should we do then? Wait. Boss, these protesters are back again. More of them. Some even have cameras. Must be reports from local newspapers. What should we do, bro? Sniper. Is the health bureau open? Uh, of course it's open. Ding Xiao, go outside and find a public phone booth. Call the health bureau. Tell them we're using substandard one. They're dead residents. Also tell them about the protest outside. Wait, boss. What you say? What are you doing? Do what I told you. Report our own factory. Understand? Boss, yeah, do what he said. No nonsense. Gilly, you also find a phone booth. Call the TV station. Tell them there's breaking news. Sure. Good news! Huge good news! Protesters at Yuten's place is more than 700! People from Health Bureau, Police, even TV station are there! More than 700? How many we arranged? About a dozen. Ain't right. Abnormal. What's abnormal about it? This means... Rumors are spreading! It won't take long before Yuten's factory gets shut down. Go and see for yourself. When I arrive there, see what happened. Don't mind mistakes. Immoral businessman! Immoral businessman! Immoral businessman! Immoral businessman! Immoral businessman! Why are you saying we're immoral businessman? Where's the evidence? We don't need the evidence! Everyone knows you're using cutter oil, right? Right, 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 right! right. Then you explain to us what cutter oil is. Cutter oil! Ordinary people only know that. It's unsafe and harmful. What you know? This matter can't be baseless. Your oil must be unsafe. Unsafe, unsafe, unsafe. 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 Whether my oil is unsafe or not, isn't for you to decide. Make way. City barrel leaders and reporters are coming. They have the authority to speak. Dear leaders, rumors about me is not important. Why have even you come over? But that's all right. You can vouch for my innocence. Hey, open up the workshop and warehouse for inspection! What? Yuten has proven his innocence. But the TV reporters down there are people. Is today's news big enough? Leader, there's nothing for reporting. Yuten is smart. But the spread of rumors, far more stronger than clarification. Ordinary people will follow the train. Continue to fan flames! After our inspection, the oil of this factory is indeed fine. Who knows if your oil has been tempered with? I hope you have some common sense before spreading rumors. Tons of oil. Tempered with? You said about both sides! Who knows true or false? Tempered with! 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 Contract! Saver is here. This time, I bet on my entire fortune. You must success. No failure. Sure. Listen up! Starting today, Panda Group will collaborate with Pengcheng Oil to launch co-branded instant noodles. What co-branded? What co-branded? What co-branded? Co co In simple terms, instant noodles produced by us will use the oil all supplied by Pengcheng Oil Factory. Uh, our two companies are joining forces to ensure the quality of pan and instant noodles. Absolutely there won't be gutter oil! Today our two companies, in front of so many witnesses, are forming a strong alliance. We'll definitely make headlines tonight. Is that right? Great! We will meet your expectations! Throughout the province, across the nation! Convey this message to your leaders for me. No one can stop the progress I'm making. Including Lumi. Isn't you eating just an illiterate? Surprisingly hard to eat. Exactly. Didn't he every day used to drink, gamble, and mistreat his wife? There was in the past. His current business decisions are indeed remarkable. Like this co branding method. Indeed innovative. Only among major international brands, co branding is typical. 
As for using the food industry, they don't say there's no one to pull up, but no doubt the trailblazing. Was there for him to be so arrogant? Even though he resolved the rumor crisis, market is where the real victory lies. Right. Stop. Starting now, replicate Yuten's products, engage in the price. Bro, Tian, Xin Wang's crazy. Their retail price is not only 10 cents cheaper than ours. They also provide subsidies. Every pack sold over 3 cents. Hey, furthermore, they have also introduced chicken and chocolate flavored instant noodles. So what? Their subsidies is causing huge losses. It's a form of this guy's rebate. Encourage retailers help selling. The effect is better than reducing prices. Ah, oh, bro, Tian, what should we do now? Compare prices with me. I'll let them see what's called. <laughs> Dear fellows, starting today, Panda Instant Noodles, subsidy of a hundred thousand cash, just buy crispy noodles, black cars you can enter lottery to exchange golden coins, 10 golden coins, exchange for 50 yuan, come, tell me how did you pass by, I won, uncle, 50 yuan, uh, everyone don't rush, listen to me, one more person you bring to buy, you can enter the lottery again. Enough golden coins, exchange for money. Cup noodles as well. Good buying for better price. Dad, we do subsidy of three cents. Panda get four cents. We do five cents, they give six cents. Furthermore, this month, they launched good buying, saying subsidy of 10,000. Will we fight? Price war just begin. Just begin. Dad, we sell 30 to 50,000 bags each day, including subsidies. We lose at least 20,000 each day. We lose 20,000. You can lose it 4,000. He suffers more than us. Go on to increase. He increases 30 cents. We do 35. Wait, Dad. We lose 20,000 a day. We can't afford such loss like that. You know nothing. At this time, Yu Tian doesn't dare to transfer the market shares. Cause once he loses, it's impossible to win again. No, Dad. Their raw materials can be on credit. As for price, there's little influence. But our raw materials were paid by cash. Take it easy. I have notified the bosses of material factories. They heard that Yu Tian is crazily giving subsidies, worrying about the fans will not be recouped and lost their money. I guess they all go to Yu Tian tonight, then cut the supply. Tomorrow. You're so experienced. Thanks, you two, for supporting me all the way. Boss, oh, yeah. We just be frank and put the cards on the table. Prize war between you and Xin Wang. We're not optimistic. I heard. You added two production lines, right? Hmm. They all sat outside. You buy too much, then you can chew. Asking for trouble. This half month, your debt on raw material has reached 700,000. I hate to say it. Mm. You're so keen on the price war with Jin Wang, but what you lose is all our money. So you think I will certainly lose? Xin Wang is supported by Lu Ming. Huh? As for financial resources, you're lost already. But if I've lost already, will Zhang Sitong buy products from you? Will you two live your life so happy? But if I win, I'll have a monopoly in Pengcheng. You two are my only product suppliers. Impossible. You can't win. Nothing impossible. Not only this time I win, but I also want to drive Xin Wang out of the market. Hmm. What I'll say next is about our life and death. Say, I'm thinking things like this. Thank Fuck me. I'm in. I'll bet everything on it. Can you? Uh, do I have a trust? Risk comes with chance. Thanks, you two. Willing to bet with me. Chong, this is 500,000. Enough to use for a while. Thank you, Boss Lu. When I defeat Yu Tian, including interest, I return them all. 
Dad! See? Panda Group has launched the potato chips. And priced beef noodles. This half month, we only fed his own price war. We could go to selling private at gates of schools. <laughs> then what? It became popular? That's right. They also work out such cucumber flavor chips. Prices are high but taste fresh. And such as... Oh, the braised beef noodles have three seasoning packs. So good that people won't waste the soup. If their products continue to be so popular, they'll surely influence our sales volumes. Boss dude, I'll go first. I'll go back and tell them. Our cooperation with Xin Wang now ended. Withdraw the investment. Bass! Jiang Zetong's group has run bankrupt. Really? Really? Oh dear. We won. We've beaten Jiang Zetong to the ground. Don't count your chickens. Let's tell Lu Ming. At least we got a step closer to victory. Right. Let's toast. To this fight! Uh, sure, go! Chess! Chess! Chess. Bravo! Wonderful! You two, you know too little. A big cooperation. Won't die so soon. Xin Wang! Uh -huh. Billy! Drink with me? Uh huh! Let go! Uh huh! Uh -huh. So hot! <laughs> I said fuck up! Are you deaf? Damn! I just wanna see you check how hot are you! What are you doing? Let me go! Let me go! How dare you touch my woman! You? <laughs> it's Brotier! This is Brotier's woman! <laughs> then I won't interrupt your enjoyment! Huh? Huh? Where's your woman? Take your sticky hand away! Where's your hand? You're not sexy. No need to be panicked. You! You said who's not sexy! Young girls nowadays. Hurry home! You! Something happened. With the factory? It's Dodo! Hey! Hey! Uh, Peter, Dodo just passed out. She's rescued inside. <sighs> It'll be fine. We believe doctors. <laughs> the specialist is not here yet. What? Doctors are operating emergency. They said... Today Dodo has to receive the surgery. Otherwise... Otherwise she's gonna die today. Relax. Let's tell the director to call the surgeon. No matter how much it costs. Sometimes. Money doesn't work. Zhao Tianzhuo, tell me what you know, or fuck off! Watch your mouth, I see... You really don't want to save your daughter. What you mean? What a coincidence. The surgeon you hired from other places happens to be my old classmate. <laughs> so, where is he? He can't come! Um, we had a school reunion yesterday. I mentioned the problem I had with your husband. He happened to hear that. He has always cherished our friendship, so he refused to operate the surgery. Please, Director Zhao, please say something for us. This doesn't concern you. He's mad at me. Director Zhao! What you want? Neil! Kowtow, and apologize. I've always thought you are mean. Never thought that you're worse. Threaten me with my daughter's eyes! No! My patience running out. Crawl between my legs. Think a bit longer. Your daughter won't last long. I can crawl. But will you take it? I'm gonna make you pay. Shut up. Move.
Can't do it? Let me help it. Crawl between your legs. Who are you? Throwing people with their daughter's life. I despise people mostly like you. Who are you? My granddaughter. Son, you should know. Never threat a family. If Dodo hasn't back mercy for you, you would make three cowtails. Now Dodo is dying, and you're taking advantage. You're worse than an animal. My granddaughter went operate surgery. She's a doctor of cardiothoracic. Received foreign education. Yu Tian, right? Hun. Remember, you owe me a favor. Have I met her before? No worries. As for Dr. Zhuo, it's your call. <sighs> Looks like you found someone. <laughs> Did I say you can go? What you wanna do? You wanna hit me? Hit you? I said, I'm gonna make you pay. Oh. <coughs> you shouldn't use my daughter's life to threaten me. Go stop him, or someone will die. Yu Tian, that's enough. Spare his life. <sighs> Doctor Zhuo, today I spare you, but remember, I'll ruin your life. I understand your anger, but go to the jail because of this jerk. It's not worth it. May I ask, who you really are? This is the fanciest restaurant in Pengchen. Hope you like it. Mei Sai. You are married with a kid, and still ask me out alone, man. Oh shit! I ask you out, only to say thank you. If my wife knows, she's just taking care of Dodo at home and can't make it. You mean you are a good man? How come a good man goes to this call? Hmm? You said who's not sexy? It's you. I saved your daughter's life. Ah. Uh, you owe me a favor. Ah,、uh, right, 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 right. Ah.、Uh. You're here. How is the kid? She's sleeping now. The doctor said it will only take a few days, then she can come home. Honey, it's good to have you. Hey, where's Mister I? He's discharged. But before he left, he gave his number for you and said, "When you visit Shenzhen, you should call him." He said, "People like you should not stay in this small place." Shenzhen, provincial capital. He is really someone. Bro, yeah, just now, Lu Ming Secretary called you to invite you to come eight o'clock this evening for <laughs> dinner. I knew they would come. Well, boss Zhang, how'd you do? Boss Yu,、hmm? it's always better to lose an enemy than make one. I think you two should spend some time to have a conversation. Sure. Where to start? That's easy. You sell instant noodles. They sell snack food. There wasn't competition in the first place. Due to some small grudges. You're mad at each other. From now on, you two have a choose: do your own business, do not interfere each other. Boss Lu, you're saying I should never march in the food market, sell instant noodles forever, right? It's fair for both of you. Fair? Bullshit. What make them think they have the right to share the market with me? You two don't be so arrogant. Our family here is to make peace, not to beg you. <laughs> Even if you bag me, think it's gonna work? Enough! This is no place for fighting. Yu Jie, let me ask you one thing. You here to negotiate? Since I'm here, of course. But there's always a dog barking next to you. How? We can't make a choice, of course. 
However, we can make a choose, of course. However, I want you from now on, never try to get into food market. You dare? What's she talking about? I'll give you a reasonable price to purchase your factories. This is the best I can do. <laughs> this time, I can't be sure where to cut. You two are what I love most. Managing snack market for more than a decade. Only instant noodle and bread bring your profit. Other market shares are still held by brands outside province. Boss Lu. Young as I am, I'm aware of the code of survival of the fittest. So I'll give you a favor, cut them a slice. A corporation only knows to plagiarize, but not innovation. Huh? Well, vanish eventually in a historical trend. Like you could stand forever. In seven days, I'll drive Xin Wang out of the market. Forever. Boss Lu, since you didn't treat me as a friend, I cannot give you face. This adulterated multi. Take it back. Dad! Hey Dad, where have you been? We already left. Oh, I heard. Dinner didn't go well. What? Because of that Yutian? Who else could it be? An instant noodle guy. Can't be this arrogant. Huh. Today, he nearly slapped in my face. Dad, I'll take care of it. He thinks bringing down Xin Wang makes it unstoppable. I say, he is doomed. Looking good? Very handsome. Go. Time to buy your some clothes. No. I'm shopping for you. Just take a look. Take a look. This looks nice. We agreed. If only for you, I won't buy. Excuse us. We want to try on this one. Sure. This is the best one in our store. Go. Try it. Come on. Come on. I'm really fine. Put on some makeup too. Excuse me. My friend had her eyes on this one first. I... Look good. Ah, huh, it's been a while, one and all. You come back. This gentleman is... This is my high school mate. This is my husband. Ah, uh, you must be Boss Yu. My dad said he has dinner with you yesterday. Your Boss Lu's son. Wait, Wan Rou. I was more than your classmate. I was also your ex. It turns out you are Mr. Yu. Nice to meet you. I'm the president of Edas, Sun Yue. Thanks for bringing down Xin Wang so I can swoop in. Why? I already acquired Xing Wang. Damn it. We will be in the same circle now. Please show mercy. You're welcome here to invest. But in business, it's just lose or win. Don't be vigilant. Since we are here, how about have dinner together? Is that okay, Madam Lee? I'm okay. And this dress, wrap it for Madam Lee as my gift. Let's me. You're so lucky, Madam Lee, to have such an excellent and kind husband. Hmm. Tell me about it. She finally made it. When Wan Rou left me, she lost her and married some random guy. I was so worried. Indeed. All these years, Wan Rou supported me a lot. Without her always by my side, I could never come this far. Actually, today I took you out. There's a reason. Running into you two is a coincidence. But it's also a good chance to witness this precious day. Well, all these years, 
I have always felt sorry for not having a wedding for you. Where are? Will you marry me? Yu Tian, actually, I. Whatever happened doesn't matter anymore. What matters is, you're my wife now. Excuse me, I gotta go to the bathroom. Mr. Yu, may I have a word with you alone? That won't be necessary. Just talk. It's about business. I'm going to the bathroom. Mr. Yu, I'd like to cooperate with you. How exactly? I wish to buy the share of Panda, fifty-one percent of them. If you say yes, I promise. In two years, Panda will rule in the whole province. In five years, the whole country. Huh? Looks like you want to become the largest shareholder. You're really ambitious. I'm not interested in Panda, but you. Then there are more reasons not to sell. After all, I'm married. Mr. Yu, I'm not kidding. You are either my maid or my biggest enemy. In that case, I will immediately start the operation and in the market to compete against you. You have three days to design. Give me a call. I. Li Wanrou, you really get over me in front of your new one. Show me my respect. I'm telling you. Soon, Yu Tian will have nothing left. By then, remember to come to me. If I'm satisfied, you don't need to suffer. <laughs> Listen, you ever come here, my wife You again? and your family will end up in misery. You've married a woman I fucked. Why so proud? Beg your pardon? I fucked your wife. <laughs> you think I dare not to beat you up? Go home, Terror Daddy. He wanna deal with me? Then come at me all he wants. I'm not on your friends. Work with me. In your next life. You dare? Stop right there! Miss Sun! Yu Tian, I'll kill you! I'm sorry, I made trouble again. The Lu family is so powerful in Pengchong. I'm afraid. Don't worry, we have been enemies for a long time. Nothing to do with you. Then, what Lu Zihua said, did you really believe it? What did he say? It's. When we were together, he asked me for sex. I refused, so he dumped me. <laughs> Why are you laughing? You don't believe me? How cute you are! It's a new era. Who cares about that? Come, I've got a surprise for you. Haven't you always wanted a small shop of your own? This shop has gone out of business. I bought it for you. You? Aren't you afraid I will lose money? I'm counting on the your own money. Look across the street. That's Chen Supermarket, wonderful supermarket. From them you can learn marketing ideas. Society is the best teacher. One day when you make a profit, I'll give you bigger supermarket. I am. Don't be afraid. Behind you. I'm here. Hello? Mr. Yu, the three days are up. Have you thought this through? Didn't I make it clear? Xinwang has completely become a subsidiary of Edas. I own the shares in 26%. Only 26%? The Lu family has 24%. The remaining 50% has been distributed to Pengchen's other companies. After all, in Pangchan, people want to against you are in long line. Miss Sun, you're really merciless. Facing 
such a good rival like you, of course we have to stick together. So, question again: Have you thought it over? As long as you agree, I will leave from Pengcheng immediately. What if I refuse? We'll see you in the market then. By the way, my production workshop has been installed. The raw material are all ready. <laughs> interesting. What's really interesting is coming. Okay. See you in the market. See you soon. Bad, bad news. Our delivery workers went to the supermarket, came back and told me many supermarkets don't accept our goods. I calculated there are fifteen of them. I occupy sixty-one percent of our products. Hey, wait, where are you going? Home to watch TV. Excuse me, Mrs. Sun. Do you have confidence to compete with Panda? Do you think that the factory has been only established a few months ago? Has capability to compete with Eaters? Indeed, Panda's products are cheap, but cheap is not good. Is an unchanged truth. Our motto is quality, priority, dare for the world first. Most importantly, we don't cheat students of their money. These words may kill us. Yi Dasu has labeled us as selling inferior products. Can cause the change of attitude toward us. Most people have a herd mentality. What about rising the price? They say our products are bad because we sell them cheap. Rising price. We only make us die faster, cause our market positioning is more profits, quick turnover. Eh, uh, what about develop new products? Compete with a high-end market. Too late. Now our channels have been blocked. It's a dead game we can't play. If there's no other way, we can give up this market. What? Sometimes, giving up is not a bad choice. Lin Jiang, uh, go find some delivery workers. In three days, I need 150 people. Okay, come, raise your glasses, celebrate our victory. Don't get too excited. We are just at a preliminary victory. You're being modest. Ah,、uh, 15 supermarket owners are cutting off his lifeblood of sales. How's he gonna get back on his feet? Did you say he's hiring people crazily? We don't know what he had in his mind. He had his face. Ah, capacity has been cutting off. Recruiting is just making a show, striving for dignity. But you, Tian, there's no but. You, Tian, will die sooner or later. Do the math. He should be able to live for another month. Bass, 150 men are ready. Guys. You all know something happened to Panda, but why you still chose to come here when you saw a job recruitment? Speaking of that, hey, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bro, yeah. yeah. Say something else. Because you are short of money. You want to take a gamble, and I want exactly who can fight, venture, and gamble. You're standing here. To make money, and I'm standing here to welcome Panda Express first employees. Panda Express. What's that? Well, That's I, right. I mean, today Panda Express were first officially established. This is interesting. You're no ordinary employees doing repeatable work. You're responsible for Panda's future. There's only one thing I need you to do: go to the neighboring 162 towns to set up sales outlets and distribution, to completely open up sinking market of Panda Instant Noodles. Seven days, Panda Express will be all around Pengchen neighborhood. Panda Express, Panda Express, Panda Express, Panda Express. Panda Express. Commission for the first room, half cent per package. Between the first and second, one cent per package. Second and third, two cents. What about what about sales outlets? Three cents. I've drawn up a contract. The staff will get the outlet the same contract. Ah,、uh, boss, I have a question. Do you think rural area have such a large sales capacity? Right. Even we send goods to the towns, it might not be sold out. Trade for grain. Grain. Barter. Right. I need two kinds of grain: corn and wheat. 
but be sure to notify the outlets. We don't want stale grain and moldy grain. Within a week, open up all outlets. Any questions? Uh, no problem. Once the bartering takes place, the sales in the township market will surely increase. Then let's move. Ah, uh, one more question. Once we have a lot of grain, can we eat so much? In the end, it'll, it'll turn out to be using money to buy food. We can't. But there's someone who can. You're crazy, man. What's the problem? You had my dad collect wheat and corn processed into flour and starch, then resell to you. Nothing wrong with that. But have you thought if one packet of instant noodles can trade for 10 kettles of wheat, then 5 kettles of flour after processing? 5 kettles can make how many instant noodles? Can you sell them all? In this way, the grains in your hand will be more and more. <laughs> That's right. I want to hoard grains. Instant noodle trade for grains, just like chicken feather for sugar. That's 10 years ago, isn't it? You think, is it possible that he trains the products for grain and sell the collection to the grain supply center? <laughs> That's like running into a gun. Huh. The director of the station is one of our shareholders, classmate of Zhao Tiezhu at the sock factory. Zhao Tiezhu and Yu Tian are enemies. If I go talk to them, Yu Tian won't even get into the gates of the grain center. Good, then you must keep an eye on this channel. We can't give him any breathing space. Bro, bro, bro. Bass, I've got 10,000 here. I have 20,000. Take it first, it's our savings. What is this? The catch of our factory is almost spent. It can only last three or five days at most. In the past month, I've lost over a million. Your money can serve nothing. Take it back. Bass, in three or five days, our cash flow will be cut. By then, we'll only have this pile of flour. Do you think we should reduce our stockpile? At least we can guarantee our current production line. No, we can't. If we give up now, we'll lose everything. We don't have any money. Doesn't matter. If it doesn't work, I'll borrow from loan sharks. You kidding? Bro, Ted, why do you have to suffer everything your own? What you take us for? Right, it's Yu Tian here. Who's Yu Tian? You are. Hello? Cat. You remember who I am? Mr. I. That girl from Sun Family is not easy to deal with, is she? In this box, there are gifts for you. Holy, Holy shit! shit! You've heard my story? You know Sun Yue? More than that. The girl from the family Sun. Always give her peers a hard time. Family soon developed into this girl. It's all because of her. Resolute in doing things. Ruthless and decisive. True. Once she got in Pengcheng, she cut off all my sales market. Looks like you've been through a lot. That's good. So you know, someone's better than you. <coughs> I'd like to see how you fight with her in this business battle. I can tell you now. Never mind, I'm old. Don't have the strength to think. <coughs> <laughs> Mr. I, your health. Actually, I'm calling you today to ask you something. Take care of my granddaughter, Ai Xiaoan. If she needs you, you must help her in any way you can. You are the only person I trust. Xiaoan's my family savior, let alone you spoke up. Even if you don't, I'll do whatever I can to help her. Great. If you say so, that's enough. <laughs> Kat, you're a friend. A real friend. By the way, Make a good turn around. Don't let that son's little girl look down upon you. <laughs> hmm. 
Right place, right time, right people. Are all here at last. It rains just in time. Bro, yeah? The weather forecast says it's gonna rain for 20 days. Bros will have problems delivers. And the reserve starts flour and grain. Won't get wet with them. How can we make delivers in these 20 days? There's probably a flaw. Huh? That's a big problem. Lin Xiao, map. Hey. Bass, you look at map every day. What you looking at? Our sinking market is ready, isn't it? Right. In the impression, Hongcheng is fine. Tomorrow, 11 o'clock in the Yingming building, it is will hold a victory banquet. Do you come? Miss Chun, for us you're impressive. They all say they want to toast to you that banquet. As for that loser, you can. If he's a loser, what are you? Yu Tian, what you doing here? Having dinner. This is a celebration dinner of our delis. Why are you here? Huh, I see. You can broke. So come here to beg us to let you off. Come. Kneel in back. Enough. Yu Tian is my guest today. If anyone dare to speak ill of him, don't blame me to be impolite. Welcome to Eda's group to our victory banquet. First of all, I would like to thank you shareholders who are interested in Eda's. Eda's has been established for more than two months. Our market share has raised from 0 to 80% in a short time. Today there's another person who deserves my thank you. He's here right now. The reason why Eda's has grown so well it's because of him, bit in one group, then I take the benefit. And I'm right, Mr. Yu Tian. Watching the kingdom you built is taken away by others is hard, isn't it? Can I interview you? What do you feel about your failure? Mr. Sun, people say you are a business genius. Now I've seen it. But our game... It's not over yet. Whether I lose or not, only God knows. At the end of this month, there will be a continuous rainfall. The worst part will be Qingzhou City. The amount of rainfall is close to the highest record. Crime have been severely affected. All citizens, please be sure to take precautions against floods. Hongzhen TV will keep posted for you. You collect grain for the flood. You can't think of it that way. How can you be sure there will be a flood this year? How would you know Pongcheng will be affected? If I tell you that, I can do fortune telling. Do you believe me? You are bluffing. Even if you bet right, it doesn't mean you will win. I'm going to beat you down. You said I was arrogant. I think you are the one who's arrogant. When you leave Pengcheng, I'll see you off myself. Don't bother. I haven't lost yet. It's all wrong. It's all wrong. Miss Sun, Xiao Feng has talked to me just now. We thought, once the disaster worsens, we'll affect food production. It's bound to affect ours as well. It is even worse. If this year's harvest fails because of this, not to mention our business, even people's ration will be seriously affected. Well, it come to that. You are rich. It doesn't mean the world is. There are still many people cannot afford to eat. Who will take out their food to sell us? Mason, what's your idea? The only one way is find the head of grain supply center. Ask him to sell grains to us, or to us. Don't worry, Zhao Tiezhu told me last time, the director of grain supply center is a close friend of his. As expected, Yu Tian's grains have not been purchased. I'll take care of it in a minute. Good, chance for 150,000 to him for buying grains. Must get it done. Let's talk. Go ahead. Director of grain station said more than once he wouldn't purchase my grain. Later I heard, he's a classmate of Zhao Tiezhu. Is that right? Yes. So you want to throw his relationship to stop me from selling grain to grain station, right? If you keep asking boring questions, I have to ask you to leave. What I'm about to say, 
I want you to listen carefully. To deal with the flood, your only way is to buy food from Grand Supply Center. But don't do it. Zhao Tezhu is the middleman. He can make things difficult for you. And the damage Peng Cheng is undergoing is much worse than that news reports. So the grain station is absolutely impossible to sell grain to you. Hello, is that Mr. Mayor? I'm Sun Yue. I'd like to talk about the grain collection. Zhao Tezhu has told me that I've already rejected it. The higher ups instructed to reserve grain ASAP to fight a disaster, so I can't sell them to you. You are right. Zhao Tezhu ran away with the money. Hmm, bro, yeah? The head of the grain station visited. He's outside been standing there for an hour, being drenched all over. He begged us to sell them the grain. Eh, if we sell the grain now, will we make a big profit? Of course we will. But you know what behavior this is? Making the fortune on national difficulties! Even if we're poor, we can't do such thing. Ah, uh, right. In this kind of money, we, we can't make. But bro, the grain in the warehouse can't be processed in the short term. We have to get rid of the raw materials ASAP. Otherwise, the warehouse can easily make them linker insects and mold. So, I'm gonna donate some of the grain for disaster relief. So, how much? In the name of Pendergrove, to the disaster area, I will donate a million yuan and a million packets of instant noodles. One million? That's higher than news group. Ten times higher. Mr. Yu, there must be something you want to say. I don't want to say too much. Donations are for good cause. I want to remind the people our panda instant noodles are safe. It's cheap, but also good. Some people make money, but what I earn is a clear conscience. Hmm, what a cheapskate. After today, in the food market in Pongcho, he's got a firm food hold, winning three consecutive battles. Who one dares to compete with him? That, but I can't stand it. You want to deal with him? It's a long time coming. Dad! Dad! Master Lu! Master Lu! Master Lu! Who are you? I used to work for Zhang Sutong. I also don't like the dog on stage. I'm here this time to sell you Yu Chen's scandal. We have to see your news. It's valuable or not. When Yu Chen was a loser, he was beaten by my body. That's all. Uh, my buddy kicked his tacticals off. Since then, he couldn't get erect. He even went to the hospital. Bro, I'm not caring too much about money. But if we really donate a million, the reserve fund will be less than a hundred thousand. Too dangerous. No worries. Ida's group lost a lot of money in the flood. After the interview, Panda as a conscientious company, the market will surely rebound. Next, our cash flow will be bigger and bigger. Zhengli, recruit a new accountant. You're promoted to treasurer. I can't let anyone else in charge of the money. <sighs> Hello? At last, drive me away from Pongchang. Boss, two bowls of noodles. I'm good. The last meal, you are buying me this. I can't afford such mocking noodles. If you can stand in the Hall of Honor, you must be ready to stand in the poor street. You just won me once, still cannot teach me a lesson. You are just lucky. I'm a good businessman. I always have ways to turn goods into something I need. But you, you are so blinded by your victory. Have you ever thought? In the rainy season, agricultural businesses should prepare in advance. Rather than thinking against disasters about countermeasures, you really think that without a flood I can't beat you? Do you think I'm stupid? That's too much. You know why I brought you here? To teach me a lesson. Look over there. 
On that day, I blocked the highway and the railway station. Caught him on sight. I didn't give him to you before because I was afraid he'd turn on you. He embezzled money is a foregone conclusion. At least 10 years. Recovered money has been kept in the bank. Once you're settled, bring your ID and withdraw it. Yu Tian, you have done a lot of right things. But today, you did something wrong. What is that? You shouldn't be so nice to a single lady. Although we're rivals, we're friends. I don't have friends like you, idiot. It's better to pretend not to know. I'm going home to my wife. Welcome, this one. You dance rich. Why don't you buy a bigger one? Have a look whatever you want to buy. Can I buy you? Be serious. I'm not serious. What about your husband? He's dating with Sun Yue right now. Don't know how far he's gone. Bullshit! Get out from here! Sun Yue has a good background. She's pretty too. Yu Tian's rich now, he's looking for someone better. That's normal, right? Unlike me, I'm only devoted to you. Get out! I'm closing the door! Close the door! I'll help you. Come down, you're breaking the law. Breaking the law! In Peng Cheng, I am the law! Bro, Tin, come back! Lose a wife for in your wife at the supermarket! Let her go! I've notified you, Tian. You wait. Dilly! Dilly! He's nobody! How dare he stop wolf against me! I'm fine. Dilly! Doctor, how's my bro? Out of danger. But he can't keep his lab. Buddy, I brought you the man. Mr. Lu, you know what happened. You haven't even apologized yet. You dare? Name your price. 50,000. 100,000. Over a million. What compensate for a bro's leg? Compensate? I want his leg. Idiot! Think it over! If you mess up, it won't do you any good. You have wife and daughter in a factory. Besides, it was Fanny yesterday! So I was never awoke. Yes, it was me. Was you? Uh, ah, 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 ah. You think I'm stupid? You know, I ask again, who did it? It's me, 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 I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. What do you want to do? Mm. Sorry, please let him go. You dare? Don't be impulsive.
The Horror! Lumia, name your price. I'll pay. Ten thousand yuan for your son's medicine. Dare to touch my family again, even if it costs my life. I'll take your family with me! Fuck off! Today, Panda Group sets up subsidiary outside the province. At the same time, let's celebrate Panda Group sales exceeded 10 million. Now Panda Group has become a leader of the food industry in Pengcheng. Along the road, thank to the people who accompanied me, especially my bros. In the future, we will build a bigger factory in Shencheng. Our goal is to bring Pengcheng's culture and commodities to the whole country, to the world! Why is it all in Japanese? Mr. Ding, please believe us. We sincerely wanted to cooperate with you. Isn't that I donate my shares? We can work together? Exactly. As long as you sign this contract, we will arrange for you the world's leading neuroprocessist. Come. Your favorite noodles. Junglie, I decide to give you 10% more share of the company. From now on, accept me. You'll be the biggest shareholder. Bro, yeah. Actually, I... But... Next step will be uphill battles. Considering your health condition, you can just pass the work to Lin Xiang. This new financial officer will have no problem. Alright, bro. It's up to you. What you thinking about? The day that Dingley had accident, he told me that you had met Sun Yue. Hmm. To see her off, then there's a drop I need to give her. Honey, anyone say something to you? Sun Yue is beautiful and also has a good family background. Honey, I swear to God, if I dare to have bad intention, I'll. So silly to swear, I'm just joking. Actually, all I heard is from Lu Zihua. He told me this when he was in the supermarket. I felt very upset. But after thinking over, I thought you were barely to betray me. You trust me? Of course. The others are outsiders, but I know you well. Because you are unable in bad. Fine. Today let me show you, I can or cannot. My condolence. I'm so sorry, can't say farewell to Alder I myself. Fortunately, you didn't attend the funeral. Why? Grandfather had not rest in peace yet. My brother came with three international crossing brands pushing me to terminate the contract or hand over my shares in the company. Based on what? You are the successor of Alder Eye. I've been learning medicine abroad. I have no ideas about business, so I can't convince the majority. I knew it. But I promised to Grandpapa. I will guard Eye's family. These three brands at least occupy 80% of the order's quantity. If they cancel, 
The result will be very horrible. I'm here. No one can bully you. You're crazy, I saw. You really cancel the cooperation order from Pigeon Carter, Mordigate, and Playtoy. You know how much the loss it will be? Only this fabric in stock is enough to crash us down! I told her to cancel. Who the fuck you are? Yu Tie, Elder Ice Friend. You have nothing to do with our family in the first place. But now, you and I, Xiaoan, should take responsibility. Take it easy. Me and Xiaoan will solve the problem of overstocking the ice clothing factory. Meanwhile, we'll also find a way to look for other brand factories. You're dreaming. Let's start a bath. Two months. If we win, I want you to support Xiaoan. I never compete for the head of the family. If you lose, head of the family will be you. Yu Tian! What's the matter? Came all the way from Shencheng. I said I would call you. You promised to cancel the contract in two months. Now 10 days passed. The news about cancellation has been spread in the whole circle. There was too much discussion. A way to find a new brand to cooperate with has been blocked. You look visualized and worked a lot on it. Great. This is the one I know. The bricks and her and I shall Enough. I don't have time to make jokes with you. The task is tough. The time is limited. Calm down. If I have no idea, will I make the promise of two months? You have ideas? Secret is a secret. You did! Alright, alright. Now you buy some duck stone. In half month, make all the stock fabric into down jackets. Are you crazy? Brother. It is indeed winter now, but look at the temperature, except the northeast, in which city people will need a damn coat, and who can afford it? Most of people are wearing cotton jackets. Besides, which brands shall we stick on? Without a brand, who will buy our damn jackets? Elder I had a good choice, to choose you to be the successor. Your analysis is very thorough, brand value, market reaction and so on, although your major is medicine. But you have business sense. So why do you want me to process dumb jackets? Are you Edith or me? You don't listen to me? Any other ideas? Okay. Since you started bad. So I'm in. Let me see your ability, Yu Tian. Fast! Bad news! Why are you always so bold? Ding Li! Ding Li! Speak! What happened to him? He transferred company's share! And sold 10 million cases to Japanese at cost price! What? Now company has a deficit up to 20 million! What should we do? Where's him now? He... He has gone to the US! I can't imagine Dingli has done this ridiculous thing. It's not all his fault. I was busy doing business. Never think of treating his leg. Ah, it's also my fault. Didn't take care of him. Enough. Don't blame yourself too much. The most important thing is to solve the group's problem now. No worries, I got someone. Hell! The person you want, I brought him to you. Good to see you, I'm Director Hao Jian. Among the famous resellers, about 10 persons, Mr. Hao Jian is the leader. He's the most experienced. You're from Hei province. Can you speak Russian? Yes. Good. I'll make a business with you. Big deal! I have a batch of down codes. Need you to sell them to Soviet. Please. Any problems? This job, I can't do it. Although I often come and go between two countries, but this year Soviet has domestic issues. It's risky to export. Price can be volatile too. Prices change day by day. What if I say, I'll make you rich as a jewel? Hmm, <laughs> how rich? Since March, turmoil has started. I'm sure. Soviet will soon announce disintegration. By then, prices will rise 10 or even 100 times. Big opportunity for you speculators. Think of it. 10 pairs of leather shoes for a car. If you have 100 down coats, you can even exchange for a tank. It's up to your competence. That's right. You got channels. We have goods. Mr. Yu. Quite a businessman. Then make your offer. 240 yuan for each coat. First batch contains 200,000. Starting from the second batch, I'll give you a discount. 200 for each. Such large amount. 
There is only a dozen of us. If we can't take it, let's make a bet. Oh, no, 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 no. No one has the guts. In the whole Pong Chong, everyone knows you're always the winner. But I will cooperate. However, I have one condition. No, mate. I want to take 10,000 for a trial. If they sell well, we can sign a contract. Deal. Oh my god, look at this! Uh, so we're uh, disintegrated! Economic depression! Amazing! <laughs> You're all here? Speculator! So, how's the business? I thought it's not gonna work. But I never thought in Soviet life industry is so weak. Huh, economic crisis shut down more than half. Uh, cotton coats, hat, daily goods. People uh, are snapping up crazily. Sold out? More than that. They were such a hit! I'm telling you, the other day, two young guys brought two Renees to exchange for cotton coat. Fucking scared the shit out of me! <laughs> <laughs> Boss, you yeah. This time I came here bringing lots of friends and relatives. I also asked my peer to bring his friends and family. This time, we're gonna do something big! Great. Cheers! Cheers. Bass. The 200,000 down codes are worth total 48 million! So, which means the crisis that Panda and my family facing is solved at once! It's just the beginning. Real competition with Japanese is yet to come. But these 200,000 codes have special meanings. Thank you, Brother Tin. You managed to shut my brother's mouth. From now on, I will learn more from you to develop Ice Girl to the right track. Have you ever think about creating your own brand? How come? I already have a name for you. Ai ya ya. Ai ya ya. Hey ya ya. Eh? What a bright name! Bass. Lots has been compensated. The company has returned to normal operation. Then should we consider developing some new products? Like new bread? Ah, or chips? Neither. I'm not gonna develop new food products. Bass, you giving up the food industry? No, I just want to shift my focus gradually on other sectors. Bass, it's easy to earn money in the food industry these days. Why the shift? Food industry. Low threshold, fast track, making money easily, in accordance with our national conditions now. But if we stay here, that's short-sighted. Country's economic lifeline in the future could never be food industry. It's real estate. Stock. Or even internet. We can't stop moving forward. We must be the history pioneer. Only this way could we survive. Ah, uh, boss. What you just said, elude me. But, where you point, where I shoot. I promised this life Lin Chang only work for you. Come on, let's toast to the future of Panda. Cheers! Cheers! Road, yeah? You've got some nerve to come back here. You know the pen is almost ruined by you. They said they can heal my legs. I know I'm useless. But I don't want my stick. When did we ever say we're gonna leave you alone? You only care about yourself. Huh? 20 million. Where's your conscience? This is what Japanese people said. They convinced you! Ah! When you first contact with Japanese, I knew it. I didn't brush the bubble because I know... I know I'm not able to provide you the best treatment. I'm sorry, bro, Tian. I'm sorry. I don't know what I was thinking. <gasps> I didn't know the contract was a trap. I went there to get the contract he wouldn't give me. Enough. What happened happened. If 20 million could heal your leg, I would give up everything for exchange. But you can't sell out Panda. Panda doesn't belong to me alone. Also belong to hundreds of staff here. You took everybody's earnings. To benefit yourself. 
Selling it to Japanese is even worse! <laughs> I'm sorry, bro, yeah. I'm sorry, Panda! I enough! I took care of that 20 minutes. From now on, Panda. It's none of your business. You can go. Come to the wedding hall tomorrow. To attend our wedding. I said pen is none of your business. I didn't say you're not my bro. You sacrifice a leg for one role. You must come to our wedding. She's pregnant again. <laughs> Thank you everyone here in Pengcheng. Thank you for attending my wedding. Looking back, I have suffered a lot. But I'm lucky to have my friends and family's help and support. You might who I am. Especially my wife. Provided me tremendous support. So I can keep moving! Kaysar! 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 Ah! Ah! Uh, everyone, I have two good news today. My wife's pregnant again. I'm a dad of two children. <laughs> One more thing. Panda Group, officially marching in the technology sector. I believe, in the future, everyone in this country will know Hong Kong Panda. As history never looks back, economic globalization becomes inevitable. Hong Kong is too small for me, you tend to realize my dream. Too small for the future of Panda. We'll keep moving forward. Whatever comes next are all new challenges. Three, two, one! Hey!